hi guys welcome back to my channel sleep with chic that's what it is All right so i'm on the floor yes i didn't know i wasn't getting enough lighting so i'm like right in front of my window so we're just gonna deal with it you know what i mean all right so I have a shopping haul to do. I have all the bags here in front of me. So let's just get started with the first thing. Now, I have already used this two things, okay? <laughs> Don't kill me, but I actually bought myself. Let's start off with bras. Girl, yes. I got myself some sandals. I have been wearing this already as well. You can see the little tag thing. I guess they're not that dirty, so... I wear this around the house too, um, but yeah, these are super cute, aren't they? The they are so like obviously appropriate for spring and summer, so that's why I got these because I needed girl, I needed some new sandals. Okay, so the next thing that I got from Ross was this purse right here. Not a purse; it's actually a backpack. I have been wanting a little cute backpack like this so this is actually from Kenneth Cole and I paid oh my god I didn't even say the price for these I know that I paid 35 bucks maybe for this and it retailed for $98 yes so I'm so happy about this I've worn this already and I have a couple of my things in here already don't it look cute don't it do won't it do it yes it looks super cute, doesn't it? Alright, so let's start off with... I'm just gonna... I guess do clothing. So I went to Express. And, um... Girl only got one thing. <laughs> I only got one thing because... I don't know, I just didn't see a lot of cute things at Express. Anyways, I got myself just a plain, plain shirt. Just a plain, like your everyday shirt honestly it's a v-neck it's a really cute shirt just to kind of casually casually go out you know so yeah so i just got myself a cute cotton um express shirt that was like 20 bucks i know i could have gone at walmart and got, gotten myself the same thing but you know i was shopping around i was just like whatever <laughs> like i'm balling <laughs> i'm balling it's hot out here it really is it's oh yes papaya so i got myself a couple of things for papaya as well what i got myself girl i've been needing some jeans like some just i i some denim jeans honestly so i got myself a pair of just like regular like skinny denim you know it's backwards <laughs> but this one actually retailed for $19.99 so it wasn't that bad so I was like yes I need some jeans in my life and then also from papaya my sister's birthday was Friday today Sunday <laughs> I actually got her the same tattoo that I got myself I know isn't that bad I got it for her too uh, but these are actually feathers so these are super cute and I just thought that I just wanted to try more of these. So that's all I got from Papaya. Now let's just move on to Dillard's. Now, Dillard's, my local Dillard's, has a Mac, you know, a Sephora and a Mac and, you know, everything. And so I got myself some skincare products. Oh my god. Let's start off with the biggest, biggest purchase of life right now. Seriously, I don't know why I have not gotten on this bandwagon since who knows when, but I am so late to this bandwagon and I have been noticing um, just my skin. Like, I don't know if it's because of the weather transitioning. I mean, I'm living, I live in Texas and the weather is like crazy here, so I got myself the Clarisonic. Yes! I got myself the Clarisonic Mia 3. Now, they do have a Mia, I guess the original one, and then Mia 2, but I decided to get myself the Mia 3. Why? Because I just need, girl, need some help with this skin. Do you not see this? Oh, hell to the no. For real, though. This is not cute. 
But girl, yes, I got myself this and I cannot wait to show you guys a full on review, full on first impression, full on first time using it. So watch out for that video as well. Tell with this, but this one retails for, it's valued at $256 and it, I bought it for $199. So plus tax, it came out to be, let's see, I got the receipt right here. Oh no, this is my Victoria's Secret receipt. That's not it. But anyway, the girl hooked it up when um, I went up there. She hooked it up. She hooked it up. Uh, she hooked me up with some samples. She gave me a, a huge bag, like a cute bag. This is so cute. Um, so she got me some samples in here. I have a little pamphlet for it. She also hooked me up with some more samples. Like, damn girl, you really you know shout out to her her name was she gave me her number um because you know this is my first time using her skin was flawless her name is aurora aurora dominguez so yes I to use this product just speechless thing i got myself along with a clarisonic I got myself some Clinique products. Um, sh yes, some Clinique products. I just wanted to buy this product right here. Now, the girl who hooked me up with the Clarisonic, well, not the Clarisonic, but like some more, more samples, she told me about this hydration moisture, this right here. I just need some more moisture in my face. That's why I got that, you know? Um, so I have really, I don't have really, really dry skin, you know, but I do feel like some days I am a little too dry. So I, when the girl tested it on my skin, like a little, little, you know, sample. Oh my God, guys, like seriously, this feels like water on your face. Your dry skin to normal, normal skin, you need this in your life. How gorgeous is this bottle for real though like i cannot i don't think it has a scent um so oh yes look at that it's like a gel it's like a gel consistency yeah it's like a gel consistency let me just try it out for you guys and and just kind of it's like a it looks pink but do you see that? Oh, it just feels so cooling on the skin. Oh my God, I wish I would have put this on my face right now. And then for this one, I remember it's 20 bucks. This is the Acne Solution Cleansing Foam. Uh, she said that it would be perfect for your Clarisonic. Um, just, it's a foam, so it would just, and, and yeah, that is not working. So I'm actually pretty skeptical about this product. Um, I almost want to return it just because I don't want to break out like really bad because I already know the Clarisonic's going to hopefully don't break me out, please. <laughs> I do not want to go through that phase again. I I will save that for another. I'm just scared about this product. Let's just, let's just leave it that way. So the three products that I bought from MAC. Uh, there's a Studio Fix Powder Plus Foundation, um, but I bought this powder foundation, and I'm in NW35. I was going to buy the foundation to go, you know, along with this, but the girl said that they ran out of it, so I was like, so sad. I was super sad, so I was like whatever I'm just gonna get it I really want a powder foundation and she said you know obviously you can wear this alone or you can wear it on top um, and then I also bought the concealer the this one has an SPF 35 this is the studio finish um, concealer and my color is NW also NW 35 so I'm guessing my fund my foundation is NW 35 um, but yeah I bought a little small concealer um, when she put this on my face, I have like spots on my face, like on either side, like redness. And when 
she dabbed a little bit of this onto it and then put foundation over it oh my god it was like a flawless finish i was like sold i don't know why this has not been in my life and i also bought a lippy i've been wanting this one this is obviously a very like talked about lip b lipstick um it's a nude this is velvet teddy let me just take it off the little so here's the color this is just a gorgeous gorgeous color i really want to put it on <laughs> mm. oh i just love this one it's actually a it's a matte finish so girl yes i love this one this one is a pretty color i cannot wait to show i cannot wait to wear this um but anyways that is all i got from mac um yeah i think that's it guys uh my haul is officially over um thank you so 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 much for watching and of course do not forget to subscribe right up there and um look out for my spring lookbook that's coming up super soon and then of course my clara sonic review yeah Cannot be looking crusty crust. <laughs> Gotta be looking on point for you guys. Oh my god, did I just spit on my camera lens? What? Yes. Cute, huh? By the way, love me some Slurpee on some hot ass days. Get you some Slurpee, yes.